Hello, humans and freaks. So, uh, we told you, I mean, a few years ago, really, BLM is a scam. BLM is fake. BLM is not real. BLM is a racist hate group. As a matter of fact, just substitute KKK for white people with BLM for black people. You might as well. It's the same freaking thing. So, black America, how many times are y'all going to get pimped out by other fake, by other black leaders? See, they're really fake black leaders. So, the leaders of BLM, Patrice Kohler's, and these other fat lesbian women, <laughs> shocker, they're always like that. Um, these are spiritual witches. Did you not understand what we said a few years ago? BLM is founded on spiritual witchcraft. That happen to be also fat lesbian women. And the reason why I point out it's key that they are lesbian women because these lesbian women hate the traditional nuclear family structure. They hate heterosexual men and women that have children. They hate the family. This was all over their website uh, before they scrubbed it. But again, see, you're now catching up. This is a few years later. You're now catching up. But we told you this years back, okay? <laughs> Black America, how many times are y'all going to get pimped out by these false black leaders? Black America, how many times are you going to get played for suckers? We are on your side. We really are. We're on your side. But see, why I'm making this video is because, see, now it's becoming more and more mainstream news that Patrice Kohler's, the founder of BLM, she used all your money for what? To enrich herself and her friends and the other leaders. It's this classic scam. So what did they do? Okay, these are like Al Sharpton, Jesse Jackson, Barack Obama. Oh, oh, let's not touch Barack Obama, but no, I'm going there. Just like Barack Obama and Michelle Obama, false black leaders that Martin Luther King and Mal... See, Martin Luther King and Malcolm X would hate BLM. Absolutely hate BLM. You guys are doing the opposite of what they preached, which is what? Judge people by the content of their character, not the color of their skin. BLM does the opposite. Okay? And here's the ironic thing. For all you BLM supporters, this is what you do. Oh my goodness, the, 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 the leaders are black like us. They must really love us. Look at them, they're black. They're black. They could never do us any wrong. They're black like us. They're on our side. Why? Because they're black. You literally think just because somebody has black skin, they're on your side. The dumbest crap I've ever heard. Literally the opposite of what Martin Luther King said. Guys, are you awake yet, Black America? Are you awake yet? I think about a third of you Blacks are awake. The other two thirds, you're still on the plantation. And what plantation is that? The Democratic leftist liberal plantation, who is the party of racism. Oh my gosh, this just keeps getting more and more ironic and crazy by the second. Get off the plantation. You were scammed again. They took all your money. And, and, and here's what's even worse. This is why I call them race pimps. Patrice Cullors and BLM founders, they're race pimps. Pimps. They pull back that pimp hand and they said, get out there and burn those buildings and burn those businesses and kill those cops. Smack! Smack! They backhanded you like the pimps that they are. Get out to the streets. Get out on your corner. Cause chaos. And what'd you do? Okay, okay, my black leader, they have black skin. They told me to get out on the street and burn businesses down and kill cops. Okay, okay, okay. Retarded. Retarded. 
Did you know? Look it up. See, you have a brain, but you don't use it. You use your emo- you're led by emotion, not logic, not facts. Look up Larry Elder, look up Candace Owens, real black leaders of today. Brandon Tatum, real black leaders of today. And look, let me end by saying this. It doesn't matter that I'm half black and half white. It doesn't matter. You don't need to have black in your blood to speak on this. See, some of you have no black in you. And you think, well, gee, um, I, 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 I can't really say anything because I'm not black and, you know, I don't understand the struggle. I'm not oppressed. I'm not a victim. Um, I can't talk. I don't have any black in my blood. What? Do you like the truth or not? Do you know the truth or not? Then speak up. Don't give me that crap. Well, I'm not black. I can't. I can't. I, I, I can't say anything, Brandon. I'm not black. Shut up. Stand up. Tell the truth. Wake people up. This is ridiculous. All right. Love y'all. Remember, there's one race, by the way. It's the human race. I don't care if you're Asian or Hispanic. I don't care what you are. There's one race, one blood, human. It's sinful, evil people that want to divide you by so-called race. Red, yellow, black, and white, we are all equal in his sight. That's what the Bible teaches. See, Guys, it all goes back to worldview. How you view the world dictates how you act. Jesus Christ, the creator of the universe, created us all equal. Humans, guys. Humans. But we live in this world, evil world, where they say, oh, you're this, you're that, you're this, you're that. Wake up. Wake up. All right.